Then guys, welcome back. It's the food show, and I am actually in a small village today because somebody on the page said to me, "Food show, why not go to one of these small street street vendors? You know, these little small little trolleys that you find located on the streets and try out their chicken tikka." So we got ourselves three pieces of chicken tikka made on one of those skewers. Now have a look at this here. This chicken tikka here. It's as good as anything you'll get <clears throat> anywhere in the, in the world. Yeah, look at the juices flowing off that. See that? Wow. Now then, a lot of people shy away from street vendors. They wanna go out and they wanna dine at big restaurants, pay maybe triple or maybe four times the price. You come to the local street vendors, you will get yourselves a meal like this you got some fresh chicken tikka. Get a close look at that. Let me break it open for you once again. Have a look in there. Perfectly cooked, dripping with juices. How does it taste? Exceptional. Nice. Look how well it's been cooked as well. You can see all them chalk, chalk little signs on that chicken as well made on a cold skewer you're gonna get yourself two chapatis as well traditional yogurt mint sauce this is something that comes regular in pakistan bit of lemon the squeezy at the top of your chicken let's take a bite of this with the chutney you know what Absolutely amazing. Chapatis and naans are made in the clay oven as well. These are still piping hot. All this meal for one person will probably cost you about 80 pence. 80 pence, chicken tikka, two naan breads, sauce, bottle of cold water as well. It's not cold, it's a bottle of cold water. I'm gonna try to get out and find more of these street vendors, smaller places. Cause I did say when I started my tour, I would be out looking for little hidden gems. If you splash the camera around. Listen guys, it's not the Ritz Hotel. It's a nice little street vendor in the streets of Pakistan. You probably find places like this in the villages when you come in, friendly people, cracking food great price i'm gonna crack on with this it's not much of a review it's just to let you guys know i'm gonna be start looking around for the smaller street places now because this is what pakistan is about authentic food cheap prices good service what more can a food reviewer say i mean i'm happy as larry with this i've got a couple of more reviews lined up which i'm going to be putting on youtube I'm hoping, I was in uh, Azad Kashmir, that review you probably have seen already. I was in Mirpur as well. I'm gonna try getting out a bit more. There's not many more days left for me here, guys. But I tell you what, I'm gonna try to get as much content as I can on the channel. I've been working my socks off. I think I've lost about a stone running around in the heat. Ramadan is coming, Ramadan is coming as well. Next week, it's gonna be 40 degrees. I'm gonna try to do as much as I can but I will be home with you guys very shortly. In the meantime, guys, I'm gonna get cracking with this. I'll see you for the next one.